This is Dabu7. I often say this is big news, but boy is this big news. This is gold. If you want to know who shot down the flight in the Ukraine, it was Kiev. And you don't have to look any further than Kiev. They have shot themselves in the foot. And since I've announced this in this video, I've had the mainstream media put a hit piece on me. Well, the Washington Post. It's mainstream, though. It tells me they're watching me. And they've heard me. Because throughout the Twitter feeds, when all these different news agencies were pushing these stories that, look, look, Ukraine's got proof. I countered. I replied with this video. They've seen it. And, that, and then after that, that's when this Washington Post piece comes out on me. So what I want to point out here is that I, I hit a nerve, if you can't tell. There's something of deep importance here. And everyone's looking right past it. Guys, look. If you don't want to believe me, the experts have weighed in. I'm serious. You didn't want to believe a YouTuber. Well, guess what? Now we've got some exp experts, audio experts, who say that the recording is not an integral file. It is made up of several fragments. And the whole thing's pieced together rather sloppy. And you know what the kicker is? Same thing I try to tell many people. And they're like, oh, we can't believe the timestamp because of your things you've seen on YouTube with with uh, Facebook and other stuff where timestamps could be changed. This timestamp was different. A different kind. And the experts know this as well. And like once again, if you don't believe me, listen to them. This is the most powerful thing. They said that the audio tape clearly shows that it was created almost a day before the airliner crashed. So you're telling me that somebody made a video of this plane crashing the day before it crashed? Uh-huh. Well, then they would have to know something about the crash, wouldn't they? Uh-huh. I don't think that it gets more smoking gun than this, dude. They did it. They shot themselves in the foot. They're wishing they never put this piece out. They're wishing, they're wishing, they're wishing. Because they messed up. Burned it down in so many ways, just in this video. But for those of you that can see it now, you don't have to look any further. How can someone put this kind of information out? And now try to be quietly backing away from it. They're busted. Can't you see it? How can anyone create a video blaming a crash that never existed? This was created the day before. The fact that you know that, the fact that experts have told you this, verified this, I don't know what more you want. We got a criminal here. We got a criminal entity that plotted this, that knew about, that knew that this flight was going to go to, hmm, and there was also some jets escorting this thing, hmm, disappeared just a couple minutes before it got shot down, hmm, I'm telling you, you're damn lucky it wasn't packed full of disease. Guys, it's cut and dry. Kiev is behind bringing down this plane. You can continue to believe all the garbage, but for those of you that are awake, I want you to sit back at this point, and I want you to look at John Kerry. I want you to look at these goons you got in your Congress, these John McCains, all these damn fools out here that we're paying a lot of our faces. I want you to see how they react. Watch them push these lies. For those of you that are awakening like no other, welcome to the show. This has been Dabu 7.